Introduction Welcome to today's lecture on the application of nanoparticles for drug delivery to the central nervous system, CNS. In recent years, medical nanotechnology has emerged as a promising field, enabling targeted and controlled drug delivery to specific sites within the body. The delivery of therapeutics to the CNS, however, poses numerous challenges due to the presence of the blood-brain barrier, BBB, and other physiological barriers. In this lecture, we will explore the various strategies employed to overcome these obstacles and discuss the advancements made in the field of CNS drug delivery using nanoparticles. So, let's delve into the fascinating world of medical nanotechnology and its potential for revolutionizing the treatment of neurological disorders. Nanoparticles are tiny particles with dimensions ranging from 1 to 100 nanometers. They possess unique properties such as high surface area to volume ratio, tunable surface chemistry, and the ability to encapsulate or attach therapeutics. These characteristics make nanoparticles ideal candidates for drug delivery applications, including the treatment of CNS disorders. By encapsulating drugs within nanoparticles, their stability can be enhanced and controlled release can be achieved, leading to improved therapeutic efficacy. The BBB is a highly selective barrier that separates the circulating blood from the brain tissue, maintaining homeostasis within the CNS. Its unique structure, consisting of endothelial cells, tight junctions, astrocytes, and parasites, restricts the entry of foreign substances, including therapeutic agents. This poses a significant challenge in delivering drugs to the CNS. Traditional drug delivery methods, such as oral administration or systemic injections, often fail to overcome the BBB. To overcome the challenges posed by the BBB, nanoparticles can be designed to encapsulate drugs and possess specific surface properties that enhance their ability to penetrate the barrier. Formulating nanoparticles with materials such as lipids, polymers, or metals allows for controlled release and protection of the encapsulated drug. Additionally, surface modifications with ligands or targeting moieties can enhance their specificity for BBB receptors, facilitating transport across the barrier and increasing drug accumulation within the brain. Targeting strategies involve the use of ligands or specific antibodies incorporated onto nanoparticle surfaces, which can recognize and bind to receptors or antigens expressed on BBB endothelial cells or brain cells. This targeted delivery approach allows for enhanced uptake of therapeutic payloads into the desired site, minimizing off-target effects and reducing systemic toxicity. Various targeting strategies, such as receptor-mediated targeting, Trojan horse-based delivery, and cell-penetrating peptides, have shown promising results in improving CNS drug delivery. Engineering nanoparticle surface properties is critical for improving their ability to penetrate the BBB. By modifying the surface charge, hydrophobicity, or molecular weight of nanoparticles, their interactions with the BBB can be optimized. For example, the use of positively charged nanoparticles can exploit the endocytic pathways existing within BBB endothelial cells, facilitating internalization and subsequent drug release within the brain. Once nanoparticles successfully penetrate the BBB and reach the target brain cells, efficient intracellular drug release is crucial for therapeutic efficacy. This can be achieved by designing nanoparticles that respond to specific triggers, such as pH, temperature, or enzymatic activity. Stimuli-responsive nanoparticle systems enable controlled drug release within the desired intracellular compartments, ensuring effective drug action while minimizing systemic exposure and adverse side effects. Despite the immense potential of nanoparticles for CNS drug delivery, their potential toxicity must be carefully evaluated. Nanoparticles may induce cellular stress, inflammation, or interfere with normal cellular functions, thereby presenting potential risks. To overcome these challenges, researchers are actively working on developing biocompatible and biodegradable nanoparticles. Furthermore, thorough toxicity assessments and effective nanoparticle surface modifications can minimize unwanted adverse effects and ensure patient safety. Accurate assessment of nanoparticle distribution within the brain is crucial for evaluating their efficacy and safety. Non-invasive imaging techniques, such as magnetic resonance imaging, MRI, positron emission tomography, PET, and near-infrared fluorescence imaging, can provide real-time visualization and quantitative information regarding the localization, accumulation, and clearance of nanoparticles within the CNS. These imaging modalities play a vital role in optimizing nanoparticle design and assessing their therapeutic potential. In addition to the BBB, another physiological barrier called the blood cerebrospinal fluid barrier, BCSFB, restricts drug entry into the CNS. The BCSFB is formed by tight junctions between choroid plexus epithelial cells. 
Overcoming the BCSFB and achieving efficient drug delivery requires innovative approaches, such as nanoparticle-based therapies or the exploration of alternative drug administration routes, including intranasal or intrathecal delivery. These strategies aim to bypass or modulate the BCSFB for improved drug delivery to the CNS. Diseases in the CNS can affect specific brain regions, necessitating targeted drug delivery to achieve localized therapeutic effects. By utilizing region-specific transport mechanisms or exploiting the unique microenvironments of different brain regions, nanoparticles can be designed to selectively accumulate and release drugs at the desired sites. This targeted approach improves drug efficacy, reduces undesirable side effects, and enhances patient outcomes. Neurodegenerative diseases, such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease, pose significant challenges due to the complex pathologies involved. Nanoparticle-based therapeutic approaches have shown promise in treating such diseases by delivering drugs that can alleviate symptoms, modulate disease progression, or promote neuroprotection and repair. Advances in this field hold immense potential for revolutionizing the treatment of neurodegenerative diseases and improving patients' quality of life. The translation of nanoparticle-based CNS drug delivery from bench to bedside necessitates extensive preclinical studies and clinical trials. The safety, efficacy, and feasibility of nanoparticle formulations need to be rigorously evaluated to ensure their clinical applicability. Despite the challenges faced, the potential of nanoparticles in improving CNS drug delivery has sparked immense interest in the medical community and holds promise for addressing unmet therapeutic needs in various neurological disorders. In conclusion, the use of nanoparticles for drug delivery to the central nervous system presents significant potential for overcoming the challenges posed by the blood-brain barrier and other physiological barriers. By formulating nanoparticles with specific properties and employing various targeting strategies, researchers are striving to enhance drug delivery efficiency, minimize off-target effects, and maximize therapeutic efficacy. The field of medical nanotechnology continues to advance rapidly, and with further research and clinical translation, nanoparticle-based CNS drug delivery holds immense promise for revolutionizing the treatment of neurological disorders and improving patient outcomes.